everyone! Today we're going to be discussing the Radio Flyer 4-in-1 trike, also known as the Ultimate Grow With Me trike. A um, couple of things, there's a bunch of videos out there that kind of show people using the trike, but I haven't really found one that discusses all four different modes and the great advantages to them. Um, the first thing I want to start off with, is a great option, is that it does come in two different colors. It does come in the red and the pink, which I preferably like because if you have a daughter or if you have a boy and a girl, you can get the red and it's suitable for both parties. The first mode that we're going to be talking about is mode 1, which is the baby stroller. It's usually recommended for age 9 to 18 months. It's great for little ones because it does have a three-point adjustable harness that is attachable and detachable. So you can, it's nice because it has a little bit of a back support. You can see in the picture to the right there, it'll allow a little bit more neck support uh, for, the, for the littler ones. Another great thing is it does have a removable tray. So you can add, if you're going for a walk, you can put a sippy cup in there, a couple snacks, or even a couple small toys. Um, you can, there is an adjustable canopy that can be taken on and off, which is nice for longer walks. You're not in the, in the sun so much longer. Um, the, the steering wheel for it, for the uh, parental control, is height adjustable as well. So even if you have an older sibling that wants to push you know, a younger sibling, you can adjust it to their height. Or if you want to walk with your child yourself, you can adjust it to your height as well. The next mode that we're going to be talking about is going to be mode two. It's the steering trike. This is usually recommended for age 18 months to two years. Um, as you can see here in this picture, you can see the canopy and the adjustable handle for the parent. Um, a nice part of the bike is that it does have a wheel lock. You can see in the picture there's a little round circle in the front tire. That's the lock so that if you have a younger guy, 9 to 18 months, and you don't want them to um, hit their legs every time the pedals are moving, you can easily just lock it and it becomes a foot rest. Um, whereas once they start getting older and they want to start pedaling, you can easily just unlock it and it will allow them to be able to push the pedals. Another nice part of it is it does have a little trunk in the back. It's not super large, but you can still fit a couple of items if you want to bring a couple of toys or even just throw your cell phone or any other kind of items in there. Um, you can. So at this point, you can take the handle off if you would like. However, at this young of an age, you may want to keep it on just so they don't end up going into the street or off, you know, they don't end up tipping themselves over. However, once you get to mode three, the learning to ride trike, which is usually good for about ages two to three years old, you can take it off um, just as long as you have explained the rules to them about, you know, stopping on sidewalks and so forth. Uh, a good part about the bike also is that as they get older and their legs begin to grow longer, you can actually move the seat backwards. That way they're not squished up to the handlebars so close. And then just a couple few pointers about riding a tricycle that are good for your child. Is that it builds large motor skills. It's a very healthy, necessary outlet to get out their energy, um, as well as it incorporates group play. So you have children that also live on your block. Going for a bike ride together would be a great group play activity. Um, as well as learning uh, arm and leg coordination. They realize that when they turn a certain way, the bike's going to move a certain way. And when they push the wheels forward, they're going to be going forward. Um, the next mode, the last mode, is mode four. It's the classic trike. It's usually around age three to five is when children start to learn how to ride a tricycle on their own. They have the correct balance to kind of stay on the bike. And the, again, they start to learn that when they push the pedals forward, they're going to go forward. And when they push the pedals backward, they're going to go backwards. Um, as far as the hand-eye coordination, they realize getting on and off of the bike, they realize that it's going to be moving. So they realize that they have to keep their hands on the handlebars until their feet are on the ground and they have a steady balance. Um, again, once they start learning to ride by themselves, it is recommended that you, of course, not leave them alone riding their bikes, especially um, on sidewalks. Um, it's not recommended to go on sidewalks, but if you can't really help it, um, just remember to start teaching your child at a young age the rules of the of the road for bicycling. Um, a good habit to get into would be to um, if you're riding on a sidewalk is to stop at every driveway and make sure and have your child look to make sure that there's no cars coming out because as we all know you know most cars can't see us coming so and remember you know starting them at a good young age learning to wear up a helmet will start good habits for that way when they start to learn how to ride an actual bike um, you know they'll go right for their helmet before they even hop on their bike 
Well, thank you, everyone, and I hope you all enjoy the rest um, of your day. And if you would like to purchase this product, you can just click the link below for the 4-in-1 Ride-to-Ride tricycle. Thanks so much. Have a great day.